Hey guys, this is Mike R, and today I'll be showing you one of my final OVH tutorials. This firewall you see right here is the most is the most accurate depiction of the OVH firewall, so you can just copy these onto the OVH site if you have an official OVH off of OVH.com. Um, yeah, so this is how to really make your own personal VPN. So you don't really have to pay anyone anymore. You could just you know save money a little bit. Um, so this is to whitelist your IP to your personal your home IP to port 22. This is to whitelist the proper DNSs that you like to source 53 UDP. This helps prevent some UDP spoof attacks. You'll this is going to be your VPN port. If you want to do UDP, you require an OVH game server in order to totally um, add this port to the OVH game firewall, so you can prevent rate limiting. You have to accept all UDP to have internet. You have to accept TCP established to also have internet as well. And drop everything else. Fragments is just something I added in case. I don't think it's really necessary, but some people in the other comment section said it is, so might as well add it for you guys. Next, here are the IP tables I will be providing. Here's how to find the DNS ranges that you require to add here in order to help really prevent uh, DNS attacks. So I would say first of all go to your server and then install OpenVPN first before doing any of this and this then you would go to dnsleaktest.net and then you would get the IP addresses right there then from there you go to checkhost.net and you'd be able to get the DNS ranges through the little CIDR button. They have a CIDR button there that you'll be able to find. Um, so after you do all that if you have a hint of what to do you would you would put your IP ranges here and then if you have a dynamic IP you could also do the same method go to check house click the side button get your home IP range in case they your ISP switches your IP through their range and then you put it here so you're whitelisted and then DNS range is here then you would paste all this into your VPN server and this would block basically most attacks I mean Obviously, no one would be able to hit your connection port since your home IP is whitelisted to this port. And usually, the only attacks I found that were able to ever get through was kill all, or the proper synonym is DRDOS sin. And something called the VAC killer attack, which is a attack that tricks the OVH vacuum to start vacuuming legitimate traffic. Which I don't know how they do that. And yeah. So this is how you can make a proper setup. You can copy the firewall here, or you can make your own out of it. Um, and then you can use these tables. It's not really a lot of gibberish this time. And I do hope you have a very good day in creating something that will help you protect yourself. All right. Otherwise, if you if this really doesn't work out for you and people are still hitting you off, you can just go to a path.net and get a path server. They have pretty good filters. Anyways, I'm Mike Gart. Have a good day.